All right, we're back at it. And uh, I wanted to show you the new stationary setup so I can leave this sit here and charge up a capacitor as long as I want. Um, let's take a closer look at it. I've got a half inch dowel that's about, I don't know, five feet long. Um, shoved in the ground about a foot, maybe a little deeper, foot and a half maybe. Uh, going up inside that half inch inside diameter copper pipe. Um, about six inches. I've got a hose clamp preventing it from sliding down too far and then another hose clamp doing two things. Uh, tightening it up on the dowel and uh, holding a lead on there uh, as an electrical connection. <laughs> clamp holding all of these uh, welding rods on. It's uh, some stainless steel welding rods I had laying around and I sanded those real good and I sanded the copper and uh, clamped those on there and then frayed them out. And then on a few of them, I don't know if you can see that or not, just four, I've got a stranded copper wire um, frayed out into uh, as far as I could fray it out. And then those are electrically connected. Now I'm going to set it up and we'll see how much this can charge up. I'll uh, update you when I get more. Alright, take care. Alright, so we're back for a one hour test. Let's check it out. Alright, so we just checked it at the one hour mark. And we're at one and a half volts. Uh, earlier, I did a one hour test and it was at 4.3 volts. So I was hoping to get that on film, but anyway, I guess uh, the voltage varies. We're gonna let this sit overnight and see what we can get in, we'll call it about 17 hours. So I'll give you an update in the morning. All right, see ya.